you're watching Unrelent Gaming. This is Vegeta, the Prince of all Saiyans. Make sure you subscribe to Unrelent Gaming and push the like button for me. Or else you'll be Hakai! Not Beerus. You know how this works. Make sure you enable all notifications on the channel and watch the entire video all the way through. And don't forget to follow Unrelent Gaming on both Instagram and Twitter. That's enough! On with the video. So within the last couple of days, we've been getting non-stop rumors and possible information as to what is about to happen involving the Dragon Ball IP. That of course happens to include the Dragon Ball Super anime possibly returning in 2023, along with of course new movies having to be made for the Dragon Ball Super franchise, but it would only now appear as though right now, according to DBS Chronicles over on Twitter, there appears to be a lot more going on behind the scenes right now than meets the eye, and according to the source which is Psycho Devin over on Twitter, it only now appears as though Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3 is currently in development and the expected release date for Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3 is around 2024. Now, this is without question something that so many fans have been waiting for considering the fact that Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 now, especially since its release in 2016, granted the fact that Dimps has been putting out lots of DLC, has basically been a game that's been on life support if you aren't playing the mods already. So with the conceptual idea of Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3 as according to DBS Chronicles currently in development, this is not only going to be something very big within the community as many people have been asking for so many years as to what was going on behind the scenes, why the devs weren't incorporating specific elements and fixes to certain bugs within Xenoverse 2, but it only now looks as though according to Psycho Devin and Chronicles that there will in fact be a third installment which could possibly end up being the final Xenoverse game that we end up seeing which all in all does go on to make a lot of sense especially with wrapping up the few stories and one can only imagine as to what they're going to be doing in this upcoming game considering the fact that if we do end up getting and this is a big if if we do end up getting the Dragon Ball Super anime returning in 2023 then that just means that we might get characters like Moro and Maris, Moro 7-3, Sagambo, hell even go as far as to include the current characters from the new Dragon Ball Super movie which includes Beast Gohan, Cell Max, Orange Piccolo and until of course we end up getting more information from Bandai it does look as though Xenoverse 2 is finally wrapping up, which no doubt a lot of people have been asking for for a very long time, and if 2024 is going to be the actual official release date, then 2024 is going to mark 8 years since the initial release of Xenoverse 2. So again, I want to go ahead and get your thoughts down in the comment section below. Are you guys excited? Are you guys a bit skeptical? What is it that you guys want to see in Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3, considering the fact that I do firmly believe that if this game is manifested and becomes a thing, then there's no other reason to continue the Xenoverse story if you're looking to possibly wrap it up with the third installment. So again, let me know your thoughts down below, let me know what kind of characters you guys want to see, and maybe even let me know down below as to some of the incorporations that you would like to see the company implement within the game, such as transformations, possibly even classes. So again, thank you all so much for watching, thank you all so much for your time. If you guys are excited about this, then be sure to give this video a big fat thumbs up right now by smashing that like button down below. Also, if you guys just so happen to also be new to the channel, then I do encourage you guys to go on over and smash that subscribe button and turn on all notifications by clicking on the bell icon to never miss a single video that is posted onto the channel. Tune back in for more. Thank you all so much for being here and I'll be seeing each and every single one of you down in the comment section below and in the next video. Take it easy guys and have a great day. Peace. Hello. Did you know that you can stay up to date with the latest Dragon Ball content by simply subscribing to Unrelent Gaming? Also, don't forget to follow on these social media platforms, you sexy son of a bitch. Roshi. Silent Cell. Me and the fans are having a moment. That's right. I know what you want. Extra long, thick Dragon Ball content. Quality reviews with flawless editing. Yeah. Yeah, you'd like that, wouldn't you? You dirty bitch. Roshi, the fuck? God damn it, I need them to subscribe, Cell. And we're demonetized.
Yeah, screw it. Let's cut to the video.